Hey guys, it's Eric. Today I want to talk to you about a new product that I've been trying out for probably over a month now, and that is the Ostomy Protector. Let's get started. Okay, so first to tell you a little bit about this product. Uh, this is primarily meant to be used as a stoma guard of sorts, primarily for your seatbelt. So it will help to protect your stoma from the impact of having your seatbelt over it. So I'm going to show you exactly what the problem is and then how this product helps to resolve it. So right now I'm actually wearing my uh, appliance just vertically. I don't usually wear it vertically, at least um, not for the last six months to eight months or so. I usually wear it uh, horizontally. But as you can see, when I am wearing it vertically and I go to put my seatbelt on, it kind of gets in the way. I mean, I have you know, my bag is in the way. If it's filling up, that's definitely going to be crushed. Uh, I've got my stoma and the seatbelt literally going right over my stoma. So it becomes quite a challenge to manage this. And that was actually one of my big concerns when I was uh, first going in. Actually, just before I was having surgery, I had asked my surgeon, I said, well, how, how am I actually supposed to get in a car and like wear a seatbelt and stuff? So uh, this product is meant to help with that issue. Now, the way it works is you've got these two foam blocks. Now these blocks uh, are fully adjustable. They've got Velcro so you can actually clip them onto your belt very easily. And I'll give you a quick demo exactly on how that works. So you're gonna wanna have these facing in. And what that does is it creates about an inch buffer between your seatbelt uh, and your stoma. And these loops here are really easy actually to attach to your seatbelt and you can remove them off and on if you need to you can like if you're a passenger then you can take this off and put it in the passenger side and use it there if you're traveling uh, for example by airplane you can bring this along so it's it's actually pretty convenient and it goes on pretty well but I'll, I'll show you exactly what's happening here so as you can see on my appliance uh, there's there's a nice size gap there it's about an inch or so uh, probably less, you know, now that it's conforming to the shape of my abdomen and whatnot. But you'll notice that the seatbelt is not crushing my stoma anymore. It's actually giving it quite a, a bit of space there, but I'm still protected. So in the event of an accident, if I happen to jerk forward really quickly uh, and violently, then it's pretty secure. Now, one of the neat things about this product is the fact that you can adjust this and you can also move it to the left side if you have a colostomy. I've got an ileostomy, so it's on my right side. But you can adjust this and that comes in handy. Uh, for example, if you're like me and you're wearing your bag horizontally, then spreading it out a little wider is really going to help out. You don't necessarily need it to be really, really close and tight. Now, one of the drawbacks to this product and one of the biggest issues that I've had is uh, really the fact that it's pretty bulky. And that bulkiness is something that my wife has complained about. Uh, I know, <laughs> you know, when I'm getting in and out of the car, sometimes I rub up against it and it kind of comes apart. Um, sometimes it gets twisted up when I get back in the car and I have to kind of readjust it. So those are issues that I've been having. You know, they're, they're more annoyances. They don't impact the function of the product. When I'm wearing it, it's fantastic. But the only other thing that I do want to mention, and this might be a concern for you if you're wearing a jacket, for example, in the wintertime. Uh, and here in Canada, it gets cold like 80% of the year. So for me, when I'm wearing a jacket, there's a lot of bulk going on, especially with that jacket uh, on top of there. And it really be, it doesn't, it's not very comfortable, let's put it that way. So if that's a concern for you, if you're spending most of the time, you know, in a jacket or some other apparel that requires multiple layers, this may not be the most practical product. Um, I've tried other products that are much thinner, very compact. You don't really feel them under your clothes, so that might actually be another option. Or uh, go with just a traditional stoma guard if that's something uh, that's concerning you. But for the most part, it is quite comfortable, especially when driving. Once it's on, once you're wearing it, it's fine. No issues. If you're sharing a car, uh, be prepared to have your partner or whoever you're sharing your car with be slightly annoyed. Now, you can remove it. Like when you get out of the car, you can remove it, take it inside, and then put it back, you know, when you're in the car. That's a little inconvenient. You can certainly do that. It'll certainly help um, lessen the annoyance to somebody else. But, you know, just throwing it out there, that is an option for you. So overall, would I recommend this product? Uh, 
I would have to say, yeah, I would recommend it to certain people. Not everyone. This isn't an accessory that everyone will need. But definitely, definitely if your um, seatbelt is going right over your stoma or if it interferes with your bag as your bag fills up, and I know for a lot of the time that I'm driving, uh, if I don't have it, you know, an accessory like this, I'm kind of worried that, hey, if I have to short stop or do something like that, and there's a lot of pressure on my bag already, there's going to be a problem there. So if you're if you're one of those people that happen to have those kind of problems or issues or challenges, then this will absolutely work for you, and I would certainly recommend it. Uh, but it's really not something that everybody needs to have. So those are just my opinions on that. If you've tried this product out, uh, I'm actually really interested to hear what you think, how it's worked for you, uh, if you've used it in any other types of scenarios. I haven't brought this on an airplane, for example, but if you have, I'd love to hear that. And uh, I guess we'll see you in the next review, guys. Take it easy. Bye-bye.